Hi guys, uh, today I'm going to do, as promised, I'm going to do the comparison for the same brand, Chic, Chic brand. Uh, but this round I'm going to do is the uh, comparison for the entry level. On the left hand side is the Chic B5U at 1900 NC lumens. And on the right hand side is Chic as well, but it's on the high end model. Chick C7UG at 3000 NC lumens. So now in the past I've been comparing the, the other brand from me against Chick. So today I'm gonna to do is you can see the entry level versus the high-end level. Okay, on the uh, B5U is uh, 1009 NC lumens again. Uh, on the right hand side, the contender is uh, 3000 NC lumens. From this picture, the steel picture, you already can see is uh, quite obvious right? despite even like uh, b5 you already very good in the uh, color rendering but uh, you can see the high end higher end model c7ug the skin tone and the details of the color is much much better than the b5 you so that's the differentiation between the entry level and the high end level you can see the detail the face i'm going to zoom in you can see it's very very nice for the high-end model you can see the details the lips the color the skins will go to more on a natural side you can see the lips and the skin is very very well toned now I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna play the video and uh, for you to have a look again uh, the difference for the entry-level B5U and the high-end model C7UG So here you can see the hairlines, the mascara, you know, the fur on the eye. Everything looks so sharp and very detailed. And the color is very, very natural. And while well, you see, uh, B5 is good, but it's still lack of the high-end uh, color, natural color for C7 UG. I'm gonna pause here. Okay, you look at the hair for C7UG on the right hand side comparing to B5U on the left hand side. You see which one is more natural? I mean, I leave it to you, but my vote will be on the C7UG. That's the difference on the price you pay for the entry and high end model. Okay? I'm going to pause here. I'm going to show you another video which is on the scenery part. Okay, so that you can see uh, based on skin and also on the scenery which one is actually better. So for this model, you can see the lipstick, the skin, the details, all has been segregated very nicely. Lip color, the eyes, so, so now you can see the difference. Here's another video for outdoor. I'm gonna pause here. Okay. So you see, you compare for the right hand side, the C7G, you look at the, the brightness. This is 3000 NC lumens, and on the left hand side is 1009. For the 3000 elements, obviously, we got of 3000 elements is much much brighter, and because of that, you can see all those line details, even the fur of the lion, you can see very clear. Okay, it's very bright. But here, 
For B5U, it's clear, but because of the lower brightness, only at 1009, so it's a bit dark on this side. Okay, let's continue with the video. Now, you see here, even with the uh, brightness is brighter, but uh, because C7UG is using TI 0.66 chipsets, while the B5U is still using TI, but it's using 0.47 chipset. So you look at the color and, uh, or, and also on the C7UG, you can see there's an obvious difference as well. Right here, you can see the green is greener. The grass is greener, and here, despite it's it's also green, but it is much less than the C seven UG. You can see here even the yellow grass is more clearer than the B five U, and the HDR. B5 is very good at the HDR and C7UG is even much much better you can see you look at the cloud here you can see the white spot and the blue is very equal you can see a lot, a lot of details but on the B5U you, can, you still can see the white clouds but the blue side really cover a lot of the white area right so so you see here it's a two different thing and uh, you know it, it, I would say here C7UG is much much better Let's move to another video to show the uh, skin tone which you can see even more clearer the difference different station this video I'm going to show you is the comparison you can see on both sides and the video is actually in, in a slow motion was recorded in 1000 frames per second so you can see very detailed the, uh, uh, the models that are uh, showcased in this video and uh, like I said in the C7UG is very good at reproducing the rendering of the uh, skin tone color is very very nice let's watch it Now I'm going to zoom in, pause, zoom in. Can you see? It's very obvious. C7UG, the skin tone is, you will reflect the actual color. That's the beauty of a higher end machine com in comparing with the entry level machine. Same brand, but just that one is entry level, one is higher end model, uh, level, uh, higher end model. Okay, I'm going to zoom in. Now you can see even clearer the details of the skin of the model. The right hand side C7UG is very very nice. Even the hair, the skin, the lipsticks very well differentiated. There you go. No, I have paused this screen again and you look at the on the leg again the skin color similarly here for B5U you pause again zoom in zoom in further Zoom out. Now we are back at uh, Aquaman. Similar comparison. So for those who just watch from here, 
the right hand side is uh, C7UG and the right hand, left hand side is a B5U. Okay, I will zoom in, same thing, and you can see here the details of, for Amber Heart on the right hand side and the suit for Aquaman. And you look at especially the suit, you see the gold color and the red color, the combination of the suit is well defined. But well defined, you can, you can see here, well defined. But if you look at B5U, this part is also very clear already, but the uh, definition is uh, is not as good as C7UG. The red uh, on the back, the, the mixtures of the gold is not so well defined. You see. Now I'm gonna zoom out. Let's play the video. You look at here, both is also under dark scene. The background is a bit dark, you know, it's inside the aeroplane. But you can see on the c 7 g you can see very much the details of the dark scene. Right? But for uh, b file slightly lesser details. Because the brightness is very, it's at only at 1009, here it's at 3000. And because C7G is using 0 0.66 chipsets and this one is using 0 0.47. I'm gonna to move to the next scene. So you can, from, can see from here, both HDR is also quite good, okay? But with c 7 g is much better. And you look at the stone, zoom in, zoom in again, moving a bit up a bit. You can see much more detail on the right hand side for c 7 g Zoom out. I'm going to switch on all the lights, all rows, and C7UG because of the brightness, it still delivers very, very good picture quality. Not much loss of the uh, brightness. Of course, with the lights off, it was much, much better. Okay, now you can see. The color of uh, the anti shirt and the blue you can see very clearly, just that on the C7 UG is uh, brighter. Lights on, one by row by row. Now the light is on top of the screen. From here, you can still see clear details on both sides, just that the, on the right hand side is more natural. Now, I will skip to uh, the uh, underwater scene.
from this video, you can see that the uh, uh, both the green color is uh, matching. But if you look at the brightness, C7 UG on the right hand side is much much brighter. Let's zoom in. Look at the face. You can see much brighter face on the C7 UG. And this is another scene. What I'm going to show you is if you look at the pillar. From this C7 UG, because of this, it is very detailed, you can still see some algae behind the, uh, you know, on the, on the this uh, pillar. Right? Uh, then you're on the B5 EO, you still can see, but it's not so clear the details. I'm going to move to the underwater scene. Now this is the same underwater fighting scene. Like I said, uh, because of C7G brightness, you can see more brighter on C7G, especially if you have all the lights on. Row 1, row 2, and row 3 directly above. Both equally good, but the C7G is uh, slightly brighter. Now I'm switching to YouTube. You can see on uh, C7G right hand side, is brighter. Switching to the uh, video, give me a second. Same thing, I'm gonna do the, uh, the final one with the HD video. Okay, I'm going to re reverse a bit and let you see on the uh, shoe. Now you just look at the gold part of the shoe. You can see for C7UG, you can see very clear detail. It's a gold color. Here, you can see the color slightly darker for B5U. Now let's play the MTV. Okay, so like I said, c 7 g is very good at color rendering for the skin tone. You can see the skin tone on c 7 g on the right hand side is better comparing to the B5U. Okay, So with this, uh, I end my comparison today for Cheek B5U and also the C7UG. Hope you guys get the whole pictures or what's the difference between both machines of the same brand, just difference on the brightness, uh, one is 1009 and one is 3000 silomens and also difference in chipset, one is a B5U, is based on Texas Instrument 0.47 chipset and uh, C7 g is based on Texas Instrument 0.66 chipset. Okay, so hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you like my video, remember to click like and subscribe to my channels. And good day, guys. See you again.